today we'll be once again reviewing the go-to robot and in particular we're looking at a small remote controller as mentioned before it's possible to control the robot with a remote controller or your smartphone if you have the app installed but also the Go to Pro and go to other versions come with a small remote controller that allows you to let the robot follow you. As well, you can steer the robot with a small joystick here. There are a few buttons, so once you started it, then you can let it sit. As well as stand up by pressing or once or twice the P button. Then there is L2 button on the side, which allows you to exit and enter the obstacle avoidance mode. And as well as the M button. M button allows you actually to let the robot follow you. But there are a few things that you have to keep in mind. In particular, that it has to be at around your waist height. And the robot has to be always on the right side of you. So if pressed once, Twice. We should hear the robot switching to companion mode and then you can also detect on the light that it's now in companion mode as well. We can see that we are still in companion mode. We place the remote control at around the waist height so it's detectable by the robot and we'll go around and see to what extent the robot can follow us. Please be in mind that to stay within one meter range from the robot otherwise it get lost and perhaps you can also try to see how the robot will behave once so we encounter the obstacle so i'll go and see around first i have to make sure to walk as slow as possible um, Now we can see how the robot behaves if the obstacle is encountered. A good example to demonstrate that the robot got a bit off track, but at the same time uh, it's able to maneuver uh, the traction. This is how the intelligent side follow system works on the go-to robot. And stay tuned and follow us on YouTube.